just finished rinsing my hair and having a bath let's go with my hair first so what i'm going to do i have my blow dryer and when it comes to the product i'm going to use for my hair is by cream of nature organ oil from morocco obviously i think this product is good for my hair that's something i'm going back to it because the last time when i done my hair like when i was experimenting with my hair growth and growth i actually used this one i mean this line and it was actually good so i think i'm going back into it easily like the shampoo i'm sticking with that um the conditioner i'm not so sure i'm going to check about it because i haven't used it yet so i don't know about it yet and um, as for the cream i'm going to stick with that and then this is my living the spray that i'm going to try i try it before i always like it but i stopped for a reason i don't know why but i'm going to go back into trying it and then for my heat protecting i'm going to use this one but let's go with this one this is the leave the strength and shine leave in conditioner but this is the heat protecting smooth and shine polisher i actually started liking this routine that i do and then you guys haven't seen it but i done it yesterday which was um detangle my hair i told you guys today that i detangle my hair before i didn't want people to touch my hair so i detangle myself shop shop scissors to cut my split end because i mean that split end cut it's been like when was the last time i cut my hair i think around march it was almost six six months since i last cut my hair i think november or december will be six no december will be six months so it'll be four months so i'm thinking of reducing the amount of time away for splitting my hair when i see my hair needs splitting and splitting about my detangle i was talking about um i don't know if you guys can see let me take this name tag this is always four pound fifty like four pound forty nine but i'll say four pound fifty because if one p make no difference it was like yeah so when i was trying this line i actually like the pre shampoo so i went back into it which is from the nature miracle olive and coconut water detangle and condition pre shampoo this line oh my gosh i love this line when i was trying it um my deep conditioner mask i use for my hair that i use today and this is my pre shampoo which i detangle my hair with prior to today i did single yesterday oh my gosh today it was so soft and my hair was glossy so when i was shampooing my hair i didn't feel my hair was shredding i didn't feel my hair was dry i feel like my hair was actually being like i'm going to go today took over because i'm going to listen to music and because this process i know is going to be long so i'm not going to struggle myself i'm going to enjoy myself and let's go all right guys so uh, this is me editing my video how you can see i totally finished washing my hair so i'm taking out it was washing section i tried to separate them stop at the back first i start with leave-in spray and then later on add the oil and then first detangle with my hair coming through and then use the blow dryer to stress out first with my hand and later on go with the attached comb after that i use a brush a comb to brush it out even more i do that on the low heat when it comes to the blow dryer and then later on when i get to blow dry with the comb i use a high heat i do that throughout my hair Here you can see I finished the front of my left side and the back of my left side. Now I move to my other side and I just finish doing all my hair. That's how long my hair is, the front. Now I try to pat my hair properly and come throughout my hair and check if I got every part of my hair and <laughs> yeah i was jamming to a movie then and this is the end result after blow drying my hair i decided to go back into it so that it would lay flat instead of puffing up i went back again with that tash comb on my blow dryer i was checking how long my hair was on the high puff all right guys i finished blow drying my hair how you can see for me it looked like it grew at the same time it looked like it's dead end because i'm going to cut most of it so you can imagine me sorry i'm a little bit tired hot i need to put this away so i'll get ready for my straightening hair which 
I'm going to do in a minute. I'm going to be very, 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 very careful with it. My blow dry wasn't that bad, but I can tell my bleeding need trimming. This one is this bleeding, it needs to be cut. Alright, guys, now I just decided to do the straightener. I sat by the back again, I always sat at the back because I prefer starting through the back and walk my way through. So I separate them in four sections. I went with a small one. I have my Tresemme straightener, which is the one I use. I use a small comb called my splitting when I go through section by section. And I was checking to see if I didn't leave anything out. All right guys, I just finished straightening the back of my hair and cut my splitting. I'm so bad I cut the splitting. That's why I wanted to go to this one today. Like, listen, if you see, look short long i don't know what happened but i don't want to cut it as well i don't want to cut this to make it that length because i was cutting half my splitting in just for that section of my hair look how many i cut already i'm so not happy i wish i could have gone to this salon and when i do this it's fine but look Oh, I'm regretting. Now I finished this section of this hair. I'm going to do this section of this hair and then I'll move to the front and then I'll be back to show you guys. That was the back of my hair after I finished cutting and straightening my hair. It wasn't even and I wasn't happy about it. That's why I decided to fix it soon. Now I move on to the front of my hair and there I pay more attention because some part of my hair at the front I noticed that it was thinning up and I wasn't happy. Like, I can tell that all my hair here I didn't tangle. All of this is tangled. All I like to. But I'm not going to cut all of that. I'm just going to cut that uh, bare minimum. Bare minimum. The rest for next month. That was the end result and yeah I wasn't that happy because I just noticed that my front is actually thinning up and it wasn't full like it used to. So like I say that's it so great and split and free. Um I wanted to work my hair like that for maybe tonight. Tomorrow I'm just going to braid it and then doing style and stuff like that whatever and see how it goes i may video it tomorrow so i will see you tomorrow hey guys um i got to see that's my hair after straightening i don't know if i don't know so press properly i don't know how you feel the end i cut the split end so i'm good and uh, i have work today i don't know if i should yeah I'm loving it. I think I'm going to some blow dry my hair every time I wash my hair. But I'm going to do that every two weeks instead of every week because I don't want heat, put too much heat on my hair that much. So I'm going to do that every two weeks. So I may decide to take a video to do a video about me doing the style, but I don't really have that much style due to my hair. To tell you the truth, I just leave my hair how it is, and I don't do too much manipulation to my hair. So my hair sometimes like this but normally in my natural hair so i just braid it or put a hat on top of it <laughs> because i don't really have time or i put a skull scarf i mean but i think that may be affecting my front because my front is actually breaking more it's not growing like it used to like this used to be longer but it's shorter but if i go a little bit further down you see it's long so it's like all my print my hair in this area is breaking it and i need to fix that so i need to figure out what's wrong with it anyway this is the end of this video if you guys enjoyed it don't forget to leave a thumbs up or something like that oh my me i'm just going to style this hair next time just sorry i just uh guys i just wake up and tired so i'm just wanting to let you know how my hair look like after the heat thingy and it's not like soaking like I wanted to or wish it was so I may have fell on the soaking part but if that's how it's supposed to be maybe I did my best anyway
but any still straight is not curly or it didn't reverse so that's cool anyway i will let you guys go now because i need to get ready for reaction videos which is going to be starting next week oh my gosh i can't believe it but i'm going to record it tomorrow so i hope you guys been waited because i see that my following still stay the same <laughs> it hasn't moved you haven't went down you haven't went up either so it stuck the same so i'm happy which means those people are waiting for me and they're supporting me even though most of you haven't seen my recent video i posted but the people that did and appreciate it and leaving the thumbs up i actually like you guys thank you again and i hope you guys still stay with me until the end anyway bye guys see you next time